The following contest is a Hell in a Cell match. Making his way to the ring from Manchester, England. Weighing in at 143 pounds. Danger! Morse! Just look at the swagger on display. I love it. Swagger. Really, Saxton? You know a number of people in the back just despise this superstar. Well, the WWE Universe clearly disagrees with you, Corey. Oh, and what else is new? He is physically and mentally prepared for the task at hand in his big time match. And his opponent from the United States of America, weighing in at 180 pounds, Lightning. The WWE Universe delivering quite a reaction, perhaps the most highly anticipated match of the night. He's been demanding this match for quite some time, and now he is ready to compete. approach does a superstar need in order to win a matchup like this, Corey? It's important to remember that you can't win a match like this on emotion alone. You have to devise a plan and execute. Once locked in the cell, we've seen superstars embrace a new, sadistic level of barbaric behavior. I agree, Byron, and it's all out of necessity. As we all know, Hell in a Cell matches tend to deteriorate once the competitors leave the confines of the ring. Uppercut connects. Oh, that can rock you. Boom! Oh, strong impact! Oof! Ooh! What a punch! Oh, that'll rattle you. Coming took advantage. These two showing how well scouted they each are. A counter answered by another counter. Both superstars showing great awareness of their opponent's repertoire. Another reversal. Eye for an eye here. Guys, the cell just broke. This is not good. Oh man, I did not expect that, Michael. Nobody did. Ooh. This match grinded him down a little. Wicked forearm! Did you hear that thud? Ooh, the forearm connects. All right, then. Guess this madman's climbing up the cell. Can't have anything good in store with that strategy. This is rather reckless of him. What you say? This whole match is reckless, but necessary. All right, he's at the top now. He's trying to intimidate his opponent one more time, but he's got to strike soon. 
Fisherman suplex. We knew this was going to be a vicious match, but these superstars are taking it above anyone's expectations. Proving Hell doesn't need to stay in the confines of the cell. Hell can go anywhere. Belly to belly. My goodness. Uh-oh. We've seen some battles up in the cell, and nothing good ever comes of it. It is almost impossible to prepare for Hell on Earth, but Corey, what is the key to coming out on top in this one? You gotta do things you never thought you'd have to do before, that you never wanted to do before. Brings down his opponent, and here it is, Corey! Looking for the LaBelle lock. LaBelle lock, is he gonna tap? Well, this won't win the match, but it's one way to inflict a great deal of punishment on an opponent. It's a roundabout strategy, but it might work. He needs to find a way out in short order. Can he figure it out? Breaks the grip, and he does! Chain link fence buckling with every impact. Waist lock. No, no. Belly to belly. My goodness. You kick right to the midsection. Why in the world are they doing this? They escaped the dangers of the cell just to fight up to the top where every step could be lost. Dropping the elbow. He must have seen that coming. Ooh, where's the haymaker? Do you hear the WWE Universe? They are ravenous for these gladiators who are putting life and limb on the line right now. Really just laying it in. He's returning fire. Oh, knee to the face. Everyone in this building is just waiting on bated breath. We've all seen life-altering moments come from the top of that cell. Oh, nasty stop to finish it off. Ooh, what a punch. That's how you stop your opponent. Reversal. Can they go on the attack? Trapping their opponent's arm. Crossface submission is in. But can they turn? He's given up, but you can tell his opposition doesn't care one bit. Shoulder. Warm up the engine on the ambulance. I got a very bad feeling about where these competitors are going to end up soon. Uh-oh. Harlem sidekick. Shifts it back onto him. Are these superstars even aware of the peril they're in? I think they have blinders on, Saxton. I don't think they're completely aware of their surroundings. They just have a ton of vision for each other. Oh my God! Oh, a backbreaker! Right to the spine. We knew what we were in for with this matchup, but we didn't think the hell was gonna be let loose above the cell. Landing on top of the skull. Systematic attack on that shoulder. This whole arena is standing watching these maniacs battle it out 25 feet above the ground. There. Uh oh. Harlem sidekick. Oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. And with every step up there, the amount of fear on these superstars increases. The top of the sounds like walking through a minefield. Reversal. Can he take advantage? This is beyond dangerous. This is more than reckless. No one should be up there, let alone performing these maneuvers. All tangled up. Package powerbomb. This could be the chance he was looking for. Neck is trapped. Suplex, perfect. Hammer lock. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Hell of a mountain, gentlemen, and these poor souls are duking it out at the summit. 
Waist lock. No, no. He goes right. Oh, my God. He took a massive plunge. Does he have him here? One, two, three. It's over. Brutality finally comes to an end. Let's look back on the action from the last match. Here is your winner!